There's three different date varieties available from Oasis Date Gardens. Their website, www.oasisdate.com. Two pounds of each. Um, one pound, uh, two pounds of black abata dates. Thori dates. Um, and there's clay dates. So, first one, they look like that. The, this is the Abata dates, and the texture is like a sort of like a medjool date, or I guess you could say maybe like a deglatinor, maybe. Um, maybe it's more like a deglatinor. I don't know. Whatever. Um, they're like you could eat these fresh. As far as these particular, I noticed on here, there's a few spots that look. I'm not sure. I guess that's from being out in the sun, or whatever. I don't know has a little things on it it's not totally like you no know, there's not you know some of these it look well yeah whatever they have little spots like that i don't know if that's just from sun exposure or whatever but they I mean, taste sort of like um i don't know they taste the texture tastes sort of like maj uh medjool slash to glutton or texture sort of maybe a mixture of both of those together i don't know uh, or maybe they're more like, i would say they're more like the texture of whatever um basically as far as the flavor they taste sort of um darkish or flavor like um maybe sort of molasses molasses type flavor slash I did taste a little bit of a, I guess, maybe licorice sort of flavor. I don't know. Or do they taste better? Do I like them more than Deglet, uh, what do you call it? Uh, whatever, forget about that. I'll put that one up. Then there's this date, which is that. These are these dates. And here's the thing. I did taste them, but they're very hard. And I knew they were going to be firmer, but I didn't realize how firm. These are extremely firm. Not just a little firm, they're very firm. So I don't know if they're supposed to be that firm or they just got dried out more from being... Uh, maybe they got... I don't know, they're just very dry. I didn't expect them to be that dry. They're like very, very hard. Very hard. I don't know if they're supposed to be that hard though or not. So if you're looking for something to eat fresh, would not recommend these because these, like, they're so hard. I mean, I, can't, I don't even know how, I'm gonna have to soak these in water just to be able to eat them or, or I, might, I might have to blend them or something to eat them. So, they're very hard. And then there is this last one. I made a mess in this car seat. have these and this is the one that I broke off to try they're very hard so if you're looking for a fresh something that's like you can eat it like as is these are not the type you want the Thori or the other ones are not the type you want the uh, because they're so hard like you know I'm gonna have to put these in water or something to eat them I mean I thought they were gonna be firmer but I didn't realize they're gonna be that firm so it's, it is sort of annoying. The only reason I bought was just to have something easy to eat. You know, it's healthy, and I can, can't even eat these now unless I soak them in water. It's very annoying. So, it's the end of that uh, review. It's the end of this video. I like the packaging that they did, but as far as the two varieties, the hard, firm varieties, they're so hard. I mean, I don't know if they're supposed to be that hard, but maybe these just sat in the sun too long. I don't know. If anyone's tried those before, maybe you, you know, I don't know. But I would not recommend the two varieties for eating, like, if you're gonna blend it, maybe you could use it if you, once you actually can get the pit out inside of it. You may have to soak them in water and then whatever, but. If you're just trying to look for something fresh, try the other, you know, a different variety that's softer because they're not, they're so hard.